Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm trying to set this phone up real quick, so y'all bear with me. We got to support this thing down so it don't come falling off. So bear with me, y'all. Bear with a brother. Hey, what's up? What's up? For those of y'all who just came in, do me a favor and please hit that um, like button, all right? It's 22 people right here. And I want to say hello to all 22 of my YouTube family members, man. Hey, we're about to do something with these corn on the cob. We're going to experiment, y'all, with corn on the cob today. All right, so Miss McNeil, hey, how you doing? Hey, Anita B in the house. Bam, what's up, girl? How y'all doing? Campbell, what's going on, Miss Campbell? How you doing, Miss Clark? I see you, Miss Clark. Jonathan, hey, big bro. Pamela, hey, how you doing? Miss Davis, what's up, Miss Davis? Storm Jones is in the building. My sister, Storm Jones, in the building. What am I cooking today? I'm experimenting today, Miss McNeil. I'm experimenting today with some corn on the cob. And you guys going to um, experiment with me. And you probably end up helping me out with this here recipe, too. So, um, Lala, what's up, Lala? How you doing? How you doing? Thank you for liking and also sharing this, Lala. I love you, Lala. If y'all could do what Lala did, like the video and also share the video, I would definitely appreciate it. I really, really, really would definitely appreciate it. So, who we got? D-Nice is in the house. What's up? Boomer is in the house. How you doing? How you doing? Keep up the good work. Boomer, thank you so much, my friend. I definitely would try my best. Thank you for the positive look. I really appreciate you. Steve is in the house. Veronica in the house. What's up? What's up? New viewer? Veronica, you a new viewer? All right, Veronica, you, you deserve this one. Every time a new viewer is to come in, I always do this little thingy thing that I do. Welcome to Ray Max Kitchen and Grill. Love and not hate. Love and not hate. What, what, what? Welcome to Ray Max Kitchen and Grill. And you are definitely a family, flam, a family member for life, Veronica. All right? Appreciate you. Storm Jones. Mwah! Storm Jones, I thank you, my sister, for the blessing. Thank you. Thank you, Storm. I really do. And I say this every time somebody bless me, Storm. Give and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, running over. With the same measure you meet shall be measured unto you again. And Storm, I'm going to tell you something right now. I pray, I pray, man, that there be two corners on the cobs in your life. And I pray that these two corners on the cob will multiply and give you two more. So I pray that whatever season you're in, I pray that God will give you a, a, a tremendous harvest to where you won't even have enough room to receive whatever he has for you. So thank you, my sister. I appreciate you. <clears throat> Tawana, how you doing? How you doing? Uh, Ms. Raw. Hey, Ms. Raw. I see you, girl. I see you. Hey, hey, on Goldmine. How you doing? How you doing? All right, all right. Vet, what's going on, Vet? Say I'm new to YouTube. Uh, my YouTube channel, Vet. Welcome to Ray Max Kitchen and Grill. Love and not hate. Welcome to the Ray Max family member. This is what we're going to do, y'all. We got some corn on the cob, all right? So I got four ears of corn, and I'm experimenting, all right? This is supposed to be um, a good way for me to show you exactly, man, how. Let me pan y'all down here a little bit so you can see what I'm talking about. Let me pan you down here. Hold for one minute. Here for one minute. Let me pan you down here. Let me pan you down here. All right. So I'm panning on this corn. And y'all, I'm going to show y'all a method where you got your, Lord have mercy, baby. Get it together. I can't even get it together right now. All right. So we got these little part right here, the half part. I'm going to show y'all how to do this, clean this corn without even having to go through a lot of the troubles and everything else. All right. And um, let's go ahead and I'm going to get started on this now. So what I'm going to end up doing, like I said, I got four coins. But I want to try to make some fried corn, y'all. I want to try to make some fried corn in the um, in the um, air fryer. Now, I don't know how many of you um, guys and gals, I'm tilting over here a little bit. I don't know how many of you have like a, um, um, what is it called? It's a wing place, y'all. It's a wing place. Oh, my God, man. It's a wing place. They sell chicken wings here, man. And then they, they do these fried corns. They sell fried corns. Let me get the name of the place, man. Um, 
it's gonna come. I can't even think about think the name of the wing place right now. But they sell fried corns and I buy from them all the time. So I'm gonna try to experiment and see if I can do something in the air fryer like that real quick. And Cheryl Lee is in the house. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, Re, 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 hold on, Re, 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 you tell my brother Galen. You tell my brother. Hold on, Re, 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 don't you go nowhere. Re, Re, is you here? Is Re, Re here? Re, Re, is you here? Put an X now. Wing stop. There it is. Wing stop. That's what I'm talking about. I love y'all. Re, 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 tell my brother Galen that I got these daggone Earl Campbell's. I sure did. I got these daggone Earl Campbell's, girl. Shoot. And I'm about, boy, Riri, I'm going to show you what I did with them. I'm going to show you exactly what I did with them. These Earl Campbell's ain't nothing but the daggone truth. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. My sister, my sister, my daughter came back from um, Texas. And for those of y'all don't know Riri, her name is Risa Richardson. Riri, if you could put an X down here, y'all go over to her channel, man, and subscribe to her YouTube channel. I love that woman. I love her and Galen. They the Wonder Twins. And for those of y'all who don't know them, a lot of y'all should know them. Y'all go over and subscribe to them for real, for real, for real, for real, for real, for real, for real. Galen mentioned these right here on her YouTube channel while they was going live. And he said the only place where you could find these at was like in Texas. And so... I went, man, and I called my daughter and I told her, I said, next time you go to Walmart, see if they got some of these Earl Campbell Polish sausages. And when she went to Walmart, she called me back. She said they did have them. I told her, I said, pick me up a couple packs of those right there. I said, please pick me up a couple packs. If it weren't for my man Galen, you know what I'm saying? I don't think I would have never would have even tried these things. But man, these moments right here. I'm going to show you exactly what I did with these, Riri. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Matter of fact, Riri, I'm going to show you right now. I'm going to show you right now before I get into um this video. Yes, I am. So, girl. All right. Let me show you, Riri, what I did with them. I got some um baked beans right here and I got some dirty rice right here. I hope you can see it. I don't know if you can. But let me see if I can get you a close-up on it. If you can. But these are um, baked beans. I made some homemade baked beans. And I used those smokes in that thing right there. And Riri, I'm telling you the auntie's God truth. Girl, them things is off the ever-living chain. I ain't lying. I ain't lying, Bri. I ain't lying. These mugs, they, they made my beans look, girl. These sausages my beans up. These baked beans homemade right here. Well, you know, I used the can, but I jazzed it up. Yes, sir. So. Yes, so. Video coming soon on that one right there, y'all. It is. It is. It really is. All right. So that's my baked bean. All because of my girl and Galen, the Wonder Twins. And that's Earl Hammer Sausage. Ain't nothing but the daggone truth. I swear to God, it is. Now, this right here is some homemade rice. I had a subscriber, a subscriber requ uh, requested for me to make some um, dirty rice. And I told the person, I said, I will. And I'm going to give that person a shout out on my own um, YouTube channel. <clears throat> Michelle A., I see you, girl. Anna, how you doing? How you doing? I see you. I see you. Um, hey, Sister J., I see you. I see you, girl. And so this is the dirty rice right here. And I'm going to give the person a shout out for this here dirty rice. You know what I'm saying? So I did make the dirty rice. And I'm trying to, you know, keep the videos coming, y'all. For those who request certain things, I'm trying my best, man, to, 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 to stay true to my word. If I say I'm going to do something, I'm going to try my best to do it. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm trying my best. I'm going to try my very best. But that ain't the reason why I'm on live today. The reason why I'm on live right now is because um I want to try to do some of this here fried corn. And thank y'all, man. Wingstop is the place. Wingstop is the place. That is the place. So. I want to try to do it the way Wingstop did it. You know what I'm saying? So the first thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to try to get some of this here um, shuck and also some of this, um, good God, y'all help me again. What we got right here, y'all? What is it called? Come on, y'all. What is it called? Let's see who know. What is it called? Jacqueline Dad, hey, how you doing? How you doing? What is this Harry stuff right here called on the coin, y'all? Come on, quiz one on. Silk. Bam! There we go. 
There we go, Paula. I can kiss you right now because my mind just went blank. Thank you so much. Thank you. Look at Regina. Look at Carolyn. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. See what's readers cooking. I see you, reader. I've been over there to see what you cooking, girl. You cooking too, for real. Keep the videos coming too, reader. Keep them coming. Keep them coming because I'm going to keep on watching them. Say, stop teasing. Right okay, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. So I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop, Miss Royal. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. Shorty Red, what's up, girl? I see you, Shorty Red. Shorty Red, I see you. You best believe you think I don't see you, but I see you, Shorty Red. What's going on with you? All right, this is what I'm going to do, y'all. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to try two ears of corn. Two ears of corn. And I ain't clean these, y'all, but I am going to end up cleaning these after this right here. I'm going to see if they'll work. But let me show you what I'm doing. I got two ears of corn in the microwave right now. All right. And I, I'm just putting them in that hole just like this. Like we say, I'm experimenting. I don't know if this will work, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed. If it does work, you know how we go to the, the grocery store and we see these coins. In there, they'd be like two, four dollars. Some places might be like four, four dollars. And then they have a big trash can sitting right there for you as well to where you could um, um, shuck, shuck your own corn while you're sitting there, whatever the case may be. There it is. So that Cajun, yes, the Cajun corn um, from, from Wingstop is the boy I'm trying to tell you. This is, what I'm, this is what I'm trying to do right now. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to. Got my corn in the microwave, two in there, it's just two. And I'm gonna put this timer set it at, I'm gonna try to set it at three, three and a half, right? Three and a half. Now I'm experimenting, I don't know how this gonna go, but I'm just gonna see, I'm just gonna see. All right, so I did see this on um, YouTube, somebody did this on YouTube, and I said to myself, I got to see if this works, I swear to God. I got to see if this works. So we're going to see now if this works. So meantime, meantime, in between time, I don't know how many of y'all right now live in Texas. But if you live in Texas, I'm telling y'all, go get y'all, try out some of this here Earl Campbell Polish sausage. And um, it's good, y'all. I'm telling you it's good. And let's see who else we got. My girl, Sister Jay, is in the house. Y'all go check out Rody to Good Cooking. That's my sister. I always say this, man. She can cook better than some male grill masters out here, y'all. And the woman be slaying in the daggone kitchen. I'm not lying. I'm trying to acknowledge all of y'all. Anthony Cloud, what's up? How you doing? How you doing? It's like, what's that, Columbia? Columbia in the house. Good God almighty. French Family Entertainment. What up? What's going on? That's what I'm talking about. Sugar living my best life. Live, I'm living my best life. <laughs> Live it out, sugar. You better go ahead. Sugar, I'm experimenting with this here corn on the car. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Y'all might help me out here a little bit, too. Y'all might help me out. And like I said, y'all go over there to um, Risa Richardson, man. And follow her. Y'all know what I'm saying? Follow her. Please follow my sister. I'm serious, y'all. You will not be disappointed. No way, no how will you be disappointed in her channel. Go over there and follow my girl on Roadie the Good Cooking. I guarantee you, you will not be disappointed in her channel. Go follow um, Fritz Family. You will not be disappointed. You know what I'm saying? No way in the world you'll be disappointed. Go over there and check out my girl Storm. You will not. You will not. This is what I want all of y'all to do. For everyone that's content creators, YouTube content creators, go ahead and put an X on this in the comment right now. The reason why you're going to put an X, I just want people, man, who, who, are, who may not be following you right now, they might have that opportunity of following you. So go ahead and put that X right now if you are a content creator so that our friends and family members can discover you and hopefully man they can follow you to the end to the day to to the ends of their life 
not just follow you for a week and forget about you, but follow you, follow you. And cooking in, um, who's that, Nina's Kitchens? I got to check that channel out. That's a new one right there. Welcome. I got to check that one out. Y'all go check out, see what's Rita's cooking. Go ahead and do that. And Christopher Rouse, you got a channel? I got to check out your channel. MC Lala, got to check her channel out. Tyler, what's up, Tyler? What's good? What's going on, Tyler? Hope all is well. Hey, Queen. Queen, love you too. Queen say, I love you. We love you. I got my son to, to sub you because you had us when we made that Dr. Pe Ooh, yes, Lord. Queen, I love you. Thank you, you and your son. All right, so three minutes is up, y'all. Three and a half minutes is up. We're going to see if this, this is going to work. We're going to see. Let me grab my cutting board. All right, let's see if this works. Let me grab these out. They ain't hot, hot. They ain't hot, hot. I'm just going to see if it's going to work. I got to see. All right, they ain't hot, hot. So what I'm going to do, let me get y'all down here real quick. Let y'all see what I'm doing. All right, bring a close-up on it. Okay. We're going to see if it works. We're going to see if this is really the, the real secret to how you can remove the husk the husk and the silk all at one time. This thing is kind of warm, so you probably going to have to have a towel just to grab this thing. So put a towel at the end down here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut right here along the car. All right? So this is the yellow corn, and that's what I cut. To cut the little horny part off, all right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to work it. See if it'll work. Let me see. Eh, not working. It's not work. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's see if it'll work. Let's squeeze it. Let me see. Squeeze. Squeeze. Matter of fact, hold on. Hold on. Let me try it like this. Since I got to pull, let me stick a little skewer in here real quick. And then I can pull. Uh-oh. Let me go deeper. All right. Let's try again. I just want to see y'all. Woo, it's hot. I need something to hold that thing. Let me see. Oh, I got you. Let me try one more again. It might be an epic fail experiment. It might be. Hold on. All right. This might be an epic fail. Let's try again. Now, it might be some stuck right here because that leaf ain't moving. Uh-oh. Grab a grip. Let me grip it. Let me grip it. Oh, man. Look at there. Look at there. You only got a few left on there. But it did pull it. Hey, that ain't bad. Y'all see that? That ain't bad. I can deal. I can go with that. What y'all think? Ooh, this hot. Hot. So I'm going to cut this end off right here. Ooh, that's hot. What y'all think? I think that might, that might be the thing right there. Ooh, that's hot. That's hot. MK Bites in the house. What up, MK? Hey, T. Murdoch, what up, bro? Boy, you know I'm glad to see you, T. Murdoch. Love you, boy. That's my brother right there. He's been supporting me since day one. I swear to God he has been. He's been supporting me since day one. Love that dude. 
So this work, y'all, what y'all think? That work, I'm finna go and do these other ones too. I'm gonna do these other ones. I'm gonna do the other one. Show no, look at it, look at that, look at that, y'all. Y'all remember Church's Chicken? Skewers? <laughs> I miss the church chicken. I miss the old style Church's Chicken. Let me do this other corn real quick. And I'm gonna put these other ones in the microwave. All right, so we got this one. I'm going to cut that one now. All right. Let me move these over here. And let's try this one. Do this the same way. Ooh, that, that one's still warm, too. Be careful if y'all do this, man, with these um in the microwave. Uh, you definitely going to have to have a rag holding that thing. Just in case. Let's see. This one's sliding off kind of easier than the other. Oh. Skewing and slip that. Woo, that's hot. I can go with this. I like this method. I do. I like this method. I like this method. You say, um, use your pot holder. I'm going to try that too, Sister J. Woo! So this work, y'all. You can throw, go and get you a whole corn. Throw that suck in the microwave. Do it just like that right there. Throw you some butter on it, some salt, and eat, eat away. Eat away like a mug. I ain't lying. How many of y'all know what that shoe peg corn is? All right, got that one done. Since I got the other ones in the microwave, come on, y'all. Go with me outside right quick. I'm doing this late. Man, I hope everybody's doing fine. I mean, everybody's doing well. The corn. It really is. That's the reason why I came on YouTube, just to see, man, if, if we could do this live together. But you guys are gonna have to um show me exactly what y'all would do as far as trying to make this um fried corn. Seriously. So I got my ribs on the grill, and somebody wanted me to do a um a recipe with country style ribs. So this is what I got here. And then, got me some baby backs right here. I'm gonna let them go. Let them continue to cook on. And country style is looking good right there. I'm gonna let them things bathe in some barbecue sauce. That's what I'm gonna do. Got my old grill out here. You don't need a fancy grill to grill. Just get you an old grill, man. Throw some charcoal up in that sucker. And get to cooking. So I got me some ribs. Somebody requested to do a um country style rib video, so that's what I got going on. Got me some dirty rice, homemade, homemade big beans. And I'm experimenting with these here corn. So how are these gonna taste? You know what I'm saying? So I got the other ones finna come out the microwave right now. And we're gonna see. We are going to see. Come on here, 14 seconds left. And I got y'all tilting over here too. It's 76 people in the room. This is what I need y'all to do. MK Bikes is in the house, y'all all go check out my boy MK. You be doing them mukbangs, man. For real, for real, for real, for real. Oh, Jesus, they hot, they hot, they hot. Yeah, they hot, they hot, they hot, they hot, they hot. They hot. All right, so let's do this one more time, y'all. One more time. One more time. We got our corn right there. Y'all can see. Come on in the room. All right. So, 
I can slide that batter right there. I'm gonna cut it right here, just above that little horn piece. And put it in now. Now, I'm gonna try to see what it does before the skewer. Oh, look at that, without using the skewer. Look at that, look at that. So what I did was I put it on four minutes instead of um, three and a half minutes. So look at there, y'all. Look at there. Look at there. Oh, that's hot. But look at there. Look at there. Did it not? Did it? Did we not do this? Did we not do this? What time is dinner? Dinner should be ready within a few. Well, one more hour, because I'm gonna let them. I gotta have my ribs together. But look at there, y'all. We did this. We did that. We did, y'all. We did that. We did that. So four minutes is what I put down. Fritz and the family. Yep, yep. That's it. Now that worked right there. I like that. Cut that little tip off right there because I ain't going to need that tip. I like that. I like that. Ooh, that's some hot corn. Throw some butter on that mud right there and call it the day. Listen, man, I'm excited. I ain't got to shuck no more corn no more ever. Boy, I finna cut the wrong end. I finna cut the wrong end. There we go. And I guess you can put them on a grill like that too, right? Put them on a grill hole. So Jay, what you think? You can still, you think you probably can still do them like this? Even if you put them on a grill hole? I don't know, but I like this though. I do. This is a good idea. Whoever came up with this idea is a genius. That's all I can say. A straight genius. All right. So now let's go ahead. And I want to go ahead and do it like this. I'm going to cut the corn this way. Half and half. Half and half. That's what I'm going to do. Half and half. So I'm going to leave two holes. And I'm gonna leave these right here because I don't know if they might eat theirs like mine. So my wife them, they they some picky eaters. So what I'm gonna do for them, let me show you what I'm gonna do for them. I'm gonna keep theirs just simple and plain. So let me grab some lumen foils right quick, clean this little stuff up. And I'm just gonna keep my wife them plain Jane because them folk be like, ooh, I don't like that. And you got the man, Lord, have mercy. So I ain't gonna mess around with they corn. You know how you women are. You know how picky you women are. Piggy women, I tell you. But I love them. I love them. And I won't trade them in for nothing in the world. I swear to God. Don't you Remember you told me you love me, baby. Let me get some salt. You said you'll be, where the salt at back there? You said you'll be coming back. I'm going to put the butter on first, then the salt. You said you'll be coming back this way again, baby. Ooh, yeah. Baby, baby, that's enough salt. Ooh, oh, baby. Plain Jane right here, my corn on the car. Plain Jane corn on the car. I love you. I really do. 83 people in the building. Come on now, 83 people in the building. All I need y'all to do is hit them like buttons for me. If you like what you see right now, if you haven't hit that like button, do me a favor. Go ahead and hit that like button. All right? Don't you remember you told me you love me, baby. You said you'll be coming back this way again. Preprequel. Kevin, what's up, girl? Kevin, what's going on with you? I ain't seen you in a minute. I hope you're doing all right, Kevin. 
Let me throw some pepper on that since you said pepper, Carrie. Carrie, what else you say? Let me see, what else you say? You say some cheese, salt, pepper, paprika. You know I'll be paying attention to you. You know I'll be paying, I'm paying attention to you, girl. So there's a little bit of paprika. See there? And some cheese. I'm going to have to do a video doing it like that and give Carrie the shout out. For real. I don't know how they might like that cheese, but Carrie, I like your idea. That's my sister right there, y'all. Carrie Parks. I ain't seen her in a minute. All right, so this is what we got, y'all. Put these mugs up for them. This is what we got right here. Now, here's my question to y'all. Check this out. Check this out. I'm putting these in the air fryer. Let me make sure I clean up some of this mess right quick. I'm going to clean up some of this mess. Queen. 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 Queen, I want to say this to you right quick, Queen. I want to say thank you so much for your liberal giving, um, Queen. I really do. And I always say this, Queen, when somebody do give. I always say, um, give and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down, shaking together, running over. With the same measure you meet, shall be measuring to you again. You are a blessing, Queen. Really, 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 you are a blessing. And I thank you. And, Queen, I don't know if you ever noticed, man, but, like, popcorn. We love some We love some popcorn. And I'm just using this as, an, as a, I guess, an example, right, an illustration. We love popcorn right and sometimes man we don't know how many kernels is in a bag of popcorn but once we put it in the microwave we can see that this little bag inflates into something big but then but for the little coins that's in it right now we can't eat it because it ain't good for as you can see our teeth as you can see my teeth yeah but i'm like this right here um i'm like this and i'm gonna tell you the honest god truth queen this is what I'm, the reason why i'm using this example because how God is going to bless you and your son and your family is just like a bag of popcorn. You don't know how many coins or kernels is in this bag. But once you put it in the microwave and you um, give it some heat and you just don't understand of that, <laughs> woo! once this bag expands, that's how your blessing is going to come. That's how your blessing is going to come. Your blessing is going to come in so many ways, it's just going to blow your mind. So I thank you. I really do. I really do thank you. So I say this, man, not to, not to be, you know, I don't take things for granted, but I always say this, y'all, and I'm going to keep it 100 with you guys. I always say this. I always say if you can help anybody, help an elderly person. You know what I'm saying? You got people who look like me. We are young. We're, we're strong and all. But if you can help anybody in life, help an elderly person. If you see them at a gro grocery store, Walmart, at a um, McDonald's or whatever restaurant or whatever, even just walking down the street, put something in their hand. Pay for their groceries or something. Don't tell nobody. Just do it and walk away and watch how God will open up the windows of heaven and he will actually pour you out a blessing. But I always would say this, don't do it to receive a blessing. Do it to be a blessing and everything will fall in this place, y'all. I'm telling you. That's the honest God truth. I won't say this if I didn't believe it. So this is what I believe. You know what I'm saying? This is what I believe. All right. Mm. Let me grab a couple more of these ingredients right quick. Cause I don't know. Y'all going to help me out. Y'all going to help me out. And I want to see who gonna, I want to see who's going to come up. We doing this, y'all. It ain't no I, I, I. We doing this because I don't know what the crap I'm doing. Okay. Now, <clears throat> this is what I got. I got my air fry over here. All right. And I'm going to show y'all what I got down here, what I'm going to be working with. Now, we got our four coins. I'm just going to do four coins right quick. I'm going to do four coins, right? So, we got the four coins. I'm going to put these to the side because they're my families right there. All right. So, <clears throat> for the batter for the corn. I got some chicken batter, right? And then I got some seafood batter, Cajun, spicy and hot. And I do know that the um, wings from Wingstop, they're Cajun. 
<clears throat> them some good daggone wings, y'all. If y'all ain't got a local, you know, no wing stop at your place, man, trust me, go there, man, and just buy the coin. If you don't want to buy no wings or nothing like that, forget the wings. Just buy the coin. All right. So right here. Okay. All right. So what do you guys want to use? Do you want to use like the chicken batter or do you want to use the seafood, um, Cajun spicy and hot batter? If you want to say this will be number one, this will be number two. If you want to use the seafood batter, hit number one. If you want to use the chicken batter, hit number two. All right. You could do that now. Number one, we got one. We got chicken. All right. We got chicken. We got fish. We got fish. We got chicken. We got fish. Fish right now is in the lead. We got fish. Fish is in the lead. Fish is in the lead. We got fish. We got fish. Yep. Fish is in the lead. Fish is in the lead. I mean, I can't say nothing else because fish is in the lead. So, what we're going to do is because y'all guys chose it. You know what I'm saying? You say I cheated and voted twice. <laughs> I, I thank you for that. You made me laugh. You said one and two. Mix it. No, have mercy. One and two. Okay. Okay. So, Right now, I think fish has got it. Fish got it. All right. So, let me find me a little container. <clears throat> let me see. Something to dredge with. Don't you remember you told me you love me, baby. So, we're going to use the fish then. So, chicken is out. All right. Chicken is out. Now, one thing that we ain't going to do. Now, listen to this, y'all. Listen to this. I'm not going to soak it in no buttermilk. That's not going to happen because I don't think that's not my cup of tea. That's not my cup of tea. Personally, that's not my cup of tea. Now, I got something other than buttermilk. And the things that I do have, and y'all let me know, or Sister Jay, you let me know too. Say, shout me out. Who is this? Tabitha? Hey, Tabitha, big shout out to my girl, Tabitha. What's going on, Tabitha? Girl, I ain't seen you in a minute. Where you been? Where you been? Anybody seen Tabitha? You tell Tabitha to bring her tail right on home. Come back home, Tabitha. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Okay, y'all, look. Big shout out to my girl, Tabitha. This is what I got. I got butter, for one. All right, I'm going to try to use this as a binding agent for the, um, for the fish batter. Butter's number one. Or we can go ahead, y'all, and use some old chicken grease. I'm country, y'all. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just that type of person. Yep, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just that type of person. <clears throat> you say, you think I should make more videos, Ray Mac? I give up. Well, Shay, let me tell you this. If you do give up, then you're not giving yourself a chance. You know what I'm saying? So the only thing I can tell you for real, for real, is to try to stay consistent in what you're doing. And there's a lot of us over here, man, that you could basically um, try to get a lot of input from. You know what I'm saying? But whatever you do, don't give up. Don't give up. All right? If you're making um, cooking videos, whatever the case may be, don't give up. And, and I'm talking to, let me see. All right. And you say kitchen living with Shay. I'm talking to you, Shay. Shay, if you really... Me and you could do a collaboration, okay? We could do a collaboration. And I'm telling you, if um if you want to do a collab together, I'm more than welcome to do one with you. But if we do a collaboration, I would just ask you to promise me one thing. Don't give up. That's it. Just promise me you won't give up. I'll collab with you. If I can help you in any kind of way possible, all right? And that's my word. So this is what I want you to do on all of my videos. You will see my um my email address is krmwwjd at aol.com. All right, Shay, hit me up. Just hit me up, okay? I'm not too hard to reach. If you want to find me, man, to, you know, if you want to try to leave me your email address or something like that, be my guest. I'll definitely try to hit you back. It ain't no try. I will hit you back, all right? So if that's my way of trying to help you out. But whatever you do, don't give up. Give yourself a chance. We got butter, we got chicken grease, 
Which one do you think, man, would work? Give it to me now. Chicken grease or butter? One is for chicken grease. Two is for butter. Come on. Anytime, Shay. All you got to do is just hit me up on my email address. All right. You got two for butter. Butter. We got kitchen grease. Butter. See, I'm ready to do a collab. You say, I'm ready to do a collab. Hey, Val, Val, boy, you, Val, I'm ready too, Val, Val. Look here, Val. Send me your email address. You hit me up on my email address too, Val. I love your cooking, boy. I tell you. Y'all go follow my man, Val, all right? Y'all go follow my man, Val. Val Dog's Kitchen. That brother can slay in the kitchen. Val, I'm ready to do a collab with you too. So, butter's in the front, y'all. <clears throat> He's in the front. Butter's in the front. That's it. That's it. Yes. Hey, Val, I do a collab with you too. And Shay, I do a collab with you also. For real, for real. All right. So, we're going to do butter. Chicken grease is out the door. Let's kick it out. Chicken grease is out the door. Now, let's go ahead and get started with this, y'all. Because I ain't going to try to prolong this live. And um, if my girl Carrie Parts is still here, Carrie, I thank you because I'm going to try to do um, a video with these here um, <clears throat> corn on the cob using your ingredients, which was like salt, pepper, um, some cheese, and some paprika. And I'm definitely going to give you a shout out for that one too. You know what I'm saying? Trying to do something different, y'all. I want to interact with all my family, man. Seriously. Seriously. Yes, go ahead and show them love. Show, 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 um, show some love. Um, in cooking in the kitchen with Shay, show my man Val Dog some love. Val Dog is a slaying, but that dude get cooking the dag on kitchen, y'all. I'm not lying. Let me pan this down a little bit. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Woo, Jesus, got too much going on over here. All right, first thing we're gonna do, say, don't forget to hit that like. Oh, Sister J, I love you. I love my girl, Sister J. Good God, I love my girl, Sister J. Sister J, my brother in law, sister in law, going to Vegas next week. They going to Vegas next week. I told him, man, I say, boy, <clears throat> there's a sister down there in Vegas I wish you could link up with. She will definitely show you a good time. But, man, I tell you, if I ever come to Vegas, which is going to happen, I'm going to search you out and so God may help me. I got to give you a, <coughs> a big old hug. Ooh, this stuff is serious. That's serious. That's, woo, that's serious. Okay, so here we go. Putting some butter on it. A lot of butter on mine. Oh, not too much butter, but yeah. Put some butter on it. I don't know how this going to work. <laughs> <coughs> Jesus. Help a brother. Boy, that fish batter ain't no joke. But it's some good stuff, y'all. All right. All right. So I see y'all helping me out now. I ain't doing this by myself. Y'all helping the brother out. So we experiment. Bam. We got that. All right. Come on, y'all. How y'all think we doing so far? How we doing so far? If you think we doing good so far, come on. Let me know. If you think we need, you know, a little bit more, we need to do something else different, let me know. Comment down now. Garlic powder. Garlic powder. Hold up. Hold up. Hold on. Let me get some garlic powder. Hold on now. Yeah, garlic powder ain't got no salt. Because one thing I'm not going to add is salt. Because this stuff got some salt. I'm not adding no salt. Garlic powder sounds good. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh, gee. <coughs> Hold on. Garlic powder. Hold on. Hold on. Now, just because you said garlic powder, who said garlic powder? Hold on. That was Richard. Hold on, Richard. Richard said garlic powder. Now, I'm not going to add no salt to this, like I said, because that fish batter already has salt. All right, um, Richard, you see I got to go through my bag. Told you. This is how we do it. Garlic powder. Garlic powder. This is how we do it, Richard. This is how we do it, baby. That's onion powder. Ooh, onion powder. That might be a bit too much, y'all. I think that might be a bit too much. Now, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try that garlic powder now. You hold up. There it is. There it is. 
That's why I say y'all carry my bag, man. Hey, I don't. If I got to go somewhere, I'm taking my bag with me. I ain't got time to be digging in no cabinets. Only time I dig in cabinets, if I so happen don't have anything that I need. All right, Rich. Let's see how this gonna work. I'm just gonna put something in there and mix that on around a little bit. <laughs> Lord have mercy. That's just a choke you. It'll kill you. <coughs> mm, Jesus. That got some heat to it right there. Okay, here we go. Y'all ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. That corn number one. Not dust off of it. That's corn number one. <coughs> God dang, boy, it's something in there. <coughs> Jesus. That's some strong fish battle right there. Oh, my mercy. All right, we got that one. All right, let's see. All right, one more, one more. What? But don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. A little bit more on that. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got. Yeah. So that's done. Move this out of the way. All right, that's done. Wipe my hands off. Ah. Yes, sir. All right, put the butter back up. Man, that fish batter has worked on me. Yes, it did. It has worked on me. That garlic powder, man. I don't know. That might be a good, might be a good little add, add um, good uh, addition to it. It can make us or either break us, but we'll find out. That's what spring minting is all about, ain't? It? I got my family to help me out. Look, y'all. So this is what we got. That's how they look. If y'all can see it real good, let me wipe this on um, lens off for you. Hold on. Close your eyes. All right, let's see if that works. Got to set you back up. Phone here. Okay. Now, see what see what we got. They coated well, right? Okay. Before I put this back in here, but well, before I put it in the, in the air fryer, do y'all think I need to add anything else to this? Right. Let me just see before we do this. Do you think I have to add anything else to this? All right. So the J, give me your input. Let me know what you're thinking as well. Let me see. Lonnie, what's good, Lonnie? Oh, Key Cam and the fam in the house. Y'all go check out Key Cam and the fam. I'm telling you something right now. That family right there, y'all, they're united by the hip bone. I'm telling you, boy. You can't, you can't find one without the other because they're always together. And if you want some excitement, you want some laughter, and you want some, you know, a good talking while eating, join Key Cam and the fam. I'm telling you, you guys will not be disappointed ever, ever in a day. Partially. You say partially. Add partially to it. Matter of fact, I got you. I got you. Who, who said partially? Who said partially? MK Bikes. God dang it, MK Bites. I, I knew I loved you. Boy, I knew I loved you. I knew I loved you. I knew I loved you, MK Bites. I knew I loved you. He say parsley. We got parsley. All right, we got parsley. We got parsley. See, cayenne pepper? I'm not going to do the cayenne. This is the reason why. Because you see why I was sneezing and coughing over there. Cajun, hot, and spicy. That fish batter is serious. That fish batter is not playing at all. At all. At all. But that's a good one, though. If I weren't using that, that um, Cajun, spicy, and hot, I would use the cayenne. That's a good one. What about some, um, some Parmesan? Parmesan. Do I got any? No, I ain't got no Parmesan. Matter of fact, let me see first before I say no. <coughs> Last time I used Parmesan. Boy, you better stop playing. You must be in my refrigerator. 
Get out my refrigerator, Vab. Vab, you all in my daggone refrigerator. All right, so Vab, we do got some Parmesan. Let's go with this right quick. Vab, you all in my refrigerator. I'm gonna tell you. Lachey, how you doing? How you doing? All right, so let's go ahead and get these in the air fryer right now. Now, let's see. Sister J, should I stand them up or lay them down? Lay them down and be fine too, won't you? Now, y'all tell me, tell me how many minutes. Because I'm new at this. I'm new at this, y'all. Stand them up. Okay. Just go with that. Stand them up. Okay. All right. We're going to stand them up. All right. Don't fall now. All right. So, look. Here's the, here's the thing I'm a jiggy. I'm going to put it at 400 degrees. I'm going to put it on 400 degrees. And then I'm going to set the timer to about 15, give or take. You know what I'm saying? 15 minutes. So it's at the highest level right now. Matter of fact, I'm going to tone it down just a little bit. I'm going to put it on about 380. And just let that go. All right? So this is what I'm going to do now. Let me show you guys what I'm about to do. <coughs> Let me show you what I'm about to do. I gotta put this thing down. Hold on. Let me put this down. Ugh. As a matter of fact, I ain't gonna show y'all how I cook my ribs, you know, because that's gonna be on the video. If I show you now, you probably won't watch the video. So there you go. Ha 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 Get that pan going. Bam. That should be enough right there. Yes. Yes. That should be enough right there. So we got that. We got that. Put this back up. Y'all with me? Y'all with me? Boys, a hundred people in the room. Come on in the room. Come on in the room. We're cooking up some fried corn. Ha, <laughs> fried corn. Man, where you coming from, bro? How you doing, partner? You just getting up here? Well, ain't nothing wrong with that. Oh, well, I see when I see. Mm, that real look good. Let me go and do this right quick. All right, y'all, let me show y'all this real quick. I got to hurry up. I got to hurry up. I'm going to take these right here. I'm going to put them in that right there. Get off that. Get off that. Take these right here and put them in there right there. Get off there. Get off there. Get off there. I'm going to put that one right there. Get off there. Get off there. Get off there. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to slide this over here. And I wonder if that's done. Ooh, look at that. Just like butter. Just like butter. Just like butter. Ooh, just like butter. Just like butter. This is how I'm going to tell you, then. Hold on. If you like that, let me see. Oh, oh, oh. I know what I'm about to do. I know what I'm about to do. They coming up off here. Yeah. I might have to do that video again some other time. They lied and messed me up right here. Ooh. Ooh. 
What else would you like? Butter. For all my lady friends out there, I showed y'all, man, there's a video where I'm showing you ladies, beautiful ladies, how to grill. And there's another lady here by the name of Sister J. That sister can cook. But check this out, ladies. Look. See that fork? Watch this. See how she go down there without no resistance? That rib is ready, y'all. Man, she is ready. Tell me, are you ready? She, she talked to me. To go all the way. You better tell me you ready, rib. Tell me, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready, baby. She said, I'm ready, daddy. You Girl, you better be ready. You better be ready. Because when I get you, girl, when I get your tail home, when I get you in that, I'm going to put so much juice on you, girl. Oh, my God. I'm going to sop your tail up, girl. You ain't ready for this. You ready for this, baby? You ready for Okay. I'm going to get you, girl. You wait right there. You get yourself nice and hot, baby. Yeah, I'll be back. I'm coming back for you, baby. You better prepare yourself for Big Daddy. Big Daddy coming to handle you, baby. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave that just like that right there. Close the lid. Put my fault down. Oh, she hit the ground. Got to go wash it. Woo! She dripping wet. Oh, yes, Lord, she is. She dripping wet. She just so... Mm. <clears throat> Sometimes you got to talk to your food. That's that connection that you have between you and your food. Here we go. Get all this stuff cleaned up. It's hot, y'all. How many degrees is it out there where you guys living at right now? And y'all hanging in here for me, hanging in here with me. That's a good thing. It's a blessing. Don't get no better than this to have friends like y'all. Seriously. It says 97 degrees. Ooh, the shade. Woo! 106. And over 100 degrees. That's what I'm talking about. Let's grind together, reader. 101, 98 degrees. So it is hot, y'all. Boy, let me tell y'all something. I went to um, Bush Gardens yesterday, me and my brother-in-law. It was just us two. <clears throat> we went to Bush Gardens. And I ain't eat no breakfast when I went out and left the house to meet, meet him at his house. And we drove all the way to Virginia to enjoy ourselves at Bush Gardens. And when I tell y'all it was hot as a mo, it was hot out there. It was hot, hot in Savannah, Georgia. Lord, Rich, Savannah. I want to, I want to go to Savannah one year before I leave this here earth. I ain't gonna lie, I swear, man. But um, Savannah, Georgia, and Las Vegas, two places I really want to go before I leave this here earth. But that that it was so hot yesterday that I almost. I about ready to throw up. We didn't, we didn't, um, we rolled everything. All the roller coasters that they had at Bush Gardens, we rolled them, man. And I mean, from the heat and being bounced around from place to place, I about ready to pass out. And I told my brother-in-law, I said, I think it's time for us to go, bro. I think it's time to go. 73 degrees? What? 73 degrees in Flint, Michigan? Lord, boy, if I could get that weather right now, and I got to go to work tomorrow. I had a three-day week off, but yeah, three days off. And I got to go to work tomorrow. Good God Almighty, boy, 73 degrees. I won't complain. I swear to God, I won't complain. It's 73 in Indianapolis? What? It's 74 degrees? What? Lord, what in the world going on? Phil is in the house. Let me see how these things looking, y'all. I think I should open it up. Cause right now I got about, it says eight minutes, but you think I should go ahead and open it up and just check it out. 62 degrees in, um, what's that, Ramona? Is that, where is that at, Rome or something? Good God. 100 in Newark. 93 in Asheville. Mm, 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 mm. 
Oh, now I don't even want to see how, how I'm, what's the temperature in Arizona. Shoot. And Shay, make sure you in boxing. If you don't do nothing else, make sure you in boxing. And my man, um, Val Dog, Val Dog still in the house. Val, inbox me as well. 170 degrees in Arizona. Oh, what? What? Woo! When I did that lemonade, when I did that lemonade um video, y'all, I, I did the lemonade, fixed it all up in the house and all the other kind of stuff. So I thought I'd take it outside to try to get better lighting to take a picture and all the other kind of stuff. And while I was standing outside, Man, sweat was just pouring down my face. I mean, it was hot. It was super hot. And I had that lemonade in my hand, man. I said, I took that last snap. I said, forget this. I said, I can make a video of this end cut and just say, hey, this, I thought it would be good because sweat was already pouring down. And what would quench your thirst? Um, no more than just a pineapple lemonade. That was the time for me to do it. I swear to God, it was hot as a mug. So we had hot weather here, y'all. I'm not used to... You know what I'm saying? 100 degree weather. I swear I'm not. I am not. Let's see. Ooh, let me lay them down now. Oh, they get cooked at the tip. Let's see what we got going. They say, don't forget to smack. Oh, mom, I like Susan J. I love my girl, Susan J. Y'all need to check out my girl, Sister J. She go live as well. When I tell y'all that sister can cook and she makes sausages, <laughs> I'd give anything to try some of her jalapeno cheddar sausages, boy, I swear. But y'all check out my girl, Sister J, man. <clears throat> that woman can cook, yes, indeed. Who else we got? He said, yes, so true, humidity is the devil. Definitely, definitely. Miss Jackson, hey, Miss Jackson. Miss Jackson's in the house. Y'all, we got about five more minutes on this air fryer. Five more minutes. Y'all stick with me now. That's what I'm talking about. Man, stick with me. Man, that daggone rice, boy, I swear that <laughs> Cajun rice is something good. Them baked beans is something special, y'all. They something special. My brother-in-law told me yesterday, he said, man, I want to make some baked beans from scratch using dried beans. I said, you can do it, bro. Shoot, just let me know when you do it, because I want to come over there and make a video of that. Seriously. Seriously. Come on here. Them ribs is ready, y'all. Mm, them ribs is ready. I need to go take them off the grill right now. That's what I'm going to go do. Take them off the grill right now. I ain't going to take them in. I ain't finna play with them. It ain't no use of playing with them. Mm -mm. Let me get me some lumen foil put on this pan. I ain't about to sit here and play with them daggone ribs. Y'all feel where I'm coming from? Man, that fork slid down them things, boy, what? And then yesterday I went to uh, a place in Virginia called Bud and Ned. Is that it? Yeah, Bud and Ned. And when I tell you, man, that that was that barbecue spot is off the hook. It's a little small. If some of you got, if y'all live in Virginia, listen. If y'all live in Virginia, Google Bud, Bud, B U Z, and Ned, N E D, barbecue, and take a trip. Take a trip to that spot. It's a small spot, but I'm telling you right now, them people got some good, they got some good freaking food, man. Hold on, y'all. You hear that thunder? You holding it down, Mr. G? Yeah, man. You staying tonight? Yeah. 
Đấy. Miss G, I got some dirty rice and baked beans. You can try two balls with a rib. I got you. Man, I ain't gonna eat all this food. I'm being honest with y'all. I'm not eating all this food. So I'm gonna take, I'm gonna go and feed my man over here. Let's do. Hold on. I'm falling over here. I got to fix this thing. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Okay, there it is. So I'm gonna feed my man over here next door. Let him get a rib. Some of these baked beans. And um. Ooh. There we go. And then I'm gonna go ahead and um take two plates down the street to my neighbors down here and let them enjoy themselves. Cause I ain't gonna cook, all, I ain't gonna eat all this food. Some of this stuff, man, I might just take and freeze. Put in my little Ziploc, um, not Ziploc, but my vacuum seal bag, throw it in the deep freezer. <coughs> Say you got the fish in the fr air dryer. Air dryer, yeah, yeah. I got it in there. I got it in there. I'm gonna give it about a couple more minutes. Cause it still ain't got brown the way I, I wanted it. But, I put that butter on now. I put that butter on now. Y'all don't think if I put in any of that chicken grease or nothing like that on it, it wouldn't help out? Just rub a little bit. What y'all think? It might mess the taste up. I don't know. It might mess the taste up. You say, what brand um, air fry do you have? Well, look. This is what I do have, but I'm gonna keep it honest with you too. It's a Magic Chef, right? And it's just one of these like um, analog type type deals or whatever. Now, my thing is that you can find an air fryer, you know what I'm saying? Whether it be at Walmart, um, Sam's, um, BJ's or something like that. And it'll probably be cheaper than, it, than this one that I do have. Some a company sent me this and they wanted me to do a review for them. You know what I mean? So I did the review, but I'm still, I'm a realist, y'all. First and foremost, and for those of y'all who don't know me, I'm going to tell you the, I'm going to tell you the truth, whether you like it or not. That's just how I am. You know what I'm saying? And I will hope you do the same for me. Tell me the truth, whether I like it or not. But I'm a realist. But the, like I say, there's there probably some good ones that's out here on the market that you can walk into a store and you can buy a man that's at a better deal. You know what I mean? But these air fryers, not trying to lie, y'all, they, they good. Uh, they good. So this is my second air fryer. Um, the first one I got, I got it from Goodwill. And for those of y'all who don't know, I am a thrifty. I thrift all the time. And I love it. For those of you who do not go out to some of these thrift stores, I'm telling you, man, y'all got to go in some of these thrift stores. You won't be disappointed, bro. There's some in, some stuff in there you might you might want. Some stuff in in the stores, man, I would say stay away from. Sometimes these stores prices they jack the prices up so high they be they higher than some of the retail stores. You know what I'm saying? And they selling junk or whatever. But when I do go into the thrift stores. I go in looking for like kitchen appliances, um, anything that I could work with that's outside, whether it be tools or or lawnmowers. I grab a lawnmower just like that, y'all. If, if, if there's a lawnmower that they're selling at a thrift store and they might say it ain't running I, and, and they might be like $25, I say I give you 20 for it and that's the fact. I say if you take 20, give me the lawnmower. They say, yeah, we'll take 20. I bring that sucker home, I clean the carburetor out, put me a new air filter in it, put, put some fresh gas, new spark plug, that sucker running. For $20, I got me a running <laughs> lawnmower because that's what I do. I, I can fix a lawnmower. If I can't fix nothing else, I can fix a push lawnmower, I swear to God. I swear to God. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. Hey, thank y'all for the thumbs up. And Sister J, you did that. Sister J, you did that. That's my girl, Sister J did that. 
I love Sister J. I tell you, man, I love Sister J. And she she is awesome, awesome to the core. This y'all can't see. Lord, I wish y'all could smell it. I'm gonna do another video on this rib. Cause this is just a two ingredient um, rib right here. I just used, I can't tell you. I'm gonna do another video. I'm gonna do another video. Cause I messed around and got here on this live and messed that one up. So I'm gonna do another video with that one. And I might have to do another video with that um real. Now let's see how these things looking real quick. Well, they coming right along. Yeah. They coming right along. Yes sir. Give me a plate. Give me a tick for an airplane, baby. Let's see, y'all. Um, read y'all comments right quick. Stay for the dinner, Val. Come on now. Give me a ticket for an airplane. All right. Got me a plate. I'm finna plate this stuff up for y'all. I know some of y'all ready to go. I'm finna plate it up. I'm finna plate it up. I'm finna plate it up. Boop. Plate it up. Plate it up. Plate it up. Plate it up. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Plate it up. Plate it up. Plate it up. Okay. Y'all got me excited, man. Y'all got me excited. Hold on. Plate it up. Plate it up. Plate it up. Plate it up. Get the plate popping. Okay, okay. Calm down. Oh. See what we got. A little bit more. She coming right along. I'm not gonna need no butter for this corn. Will I need some butter for this corn? What you think? What you think? All right, let me play this up for y'all real quick. Be right back. Let me get a plate. Don't you remember you told me you love me, baby? You said you'll be coming back this way again, baby. Baby, baby, baby. Oh, MK say parsley. That's right. MK say parsley. Let me get that. Said parsley. Dad had bail. Dad had bail. All right, MK, I'm coming, brother. I gotta get that parsley. And somebody said parmesan. Who said parmesan? Val dog. Val dog said parmesan. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Hold on. That bell has went off. What we got? Ooh! Ooh! Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Feel it? I feel it. All right, we get the parsley ready. I feel it, I feel it. Just do a little something. Just do a little something. Mm, 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 mm. Let's do a little something. Mm, we ain't gonna go through that rough chop. We're gonna leave that just like that right now. I'm listening to you, MK. I'm listening to you. Now y'all look, look, let me show y'all these right quick. Tell me what y'all think. You think I should go longer or this be good enough? 
Now that's some good. It look good, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It do. Now, I, what I could have did, oh, I could put, I could take some butter and brush it on it. No, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go with it just like this here. I'm gonna go with it just like this here. Cause I could take some butter and brush it on there, and then my, I should have did that, y'all. I should have just took some butter and put some Cajun seasoning in that butter, and then brushed it while it was cooking. Put it back in there, let it cook down again. That would have helped it brown up just a little bit more. Hmm. I should have did that. But this is just a trial. This is just a trial. So this is what we got. Next time. This is an experimentation. What do you think? I think I probably could get away with it right now. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. I'm gonna leave it just like this right here. All right, so we got these right here, man. They're looking good, y'all. They're smelling freaking good, too. I ain't going to lie to you. All right, we got that. Val Dog said some parsley. I mean, some um, Parmesan. Let me set this thing up real quick. Hold on. Hold on. This is for the corn. Hold on. Let me set this up. If y'all can see this. Okay, there we go. It's just for the corn. Ooh, ooh. Stop playing. Stop playing. All right. So next time I do this, I'm going to do this again. But next time I do this, I'm going to do this the exact same way. But what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to fix some butter. And I'm going to put some, um, probably some little Cajun in there or whatever the case may be in the butter. And I'm going to brush it. And then throw it back. I'm going to let it cook down first. And then in the middle of cooking, brush it with the butter. Then put it back in the air fryer. And bam, that'll be it. And then I can go ahead and dress it up the way I'm going to dress it up right now. All right. So this ain't nothing spectacular. But with y'all, we doing this together. The experience, there's some Parmesan cheese, right? That's Val Dog, Parmesan cheese. And then this is just me right here. This is me. I'm going to take some of this, hit it with that, right? That's just me. And then... With some parsley. This is MK Bites. MK Bites. Hit it with a little parsley. You know what I'm saying? And bam. That's it. That's what we got, y'all. That's what we got. 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 See, we did this together. Who did that? We did this together, y'all. We did this. We did this together. Who did this? We did this. It ain't no iron team. It's T. So we did this. We, we did this. What y'all think, man? What y'all think? Huh? Let me fix this plate real quick. Let me fix this plate. Y'all tell me what y'all think. <clears throat> if y'all got any suggestions, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a picture of this and I'm going to put it into the, um, I'm going to post it. And then... If you guys have like a fried corn recipe that you want me to try, go ahead and let me know. I try your recipe and then guess what? I'm going to go ahead and give you a shout out for it or whatever the case may be. And bam, I'm going to try it just to see. But we did this together, y'all. We did this together. We did that together. All right. Let me go ahead and set this plate up real quick. Na 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 Hey 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 goodbye I'm coming, I'm coming. Let me delete them right quick. I'm coming, y'all. All right, so this is what we got right here. 
So we're gonna go ahead and get this plate rolling. That's gone. This is a plate. Let me get this put up. All right, we got our baked beans. We got our baked beans. We got our dirty rice. All right. Only thing that would complete this is some cornbread. And I ain't fixed no dang cornbread. I ain't fixed no cornbread. All right, y'all. I'm going to show y'all a little tip, man. It ain't a tip because a lot of people who cook barbecue know this. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to show y'all the easy way to do this real quick. So, whenever y'all grilling or whatever, and you're about to cut the ribs, this is my thing, y'all. I say, don't cut the ribs, you know what I'm saying, um, with the meat side up. Because you, you're you going to hit bone and you ain't going to know where to cut. I will always say flip that rib over. And from here, you can see exactly where your bones are at. One bone, two bone, you know what I'm saying? Going from here to here to here to here, however you might want to do it, right? That's what I would say do. So as you cutting, if I cut here right now, there's a split. I already know. So you don't, you don't know I'm out. This is the best way that I say do it. And I ain't got my cutting board. You know I'm going to keep a cutting board. I don't even know why am I cutting on my non stick bag on pan right here, boy. I'm beat myself, give myself a tail whooping for that. All right, that's enough of that. Let my wife them indulge in that. But here's the plate. Let my rib. Good dag on rib. Ah, that rib is good. Don't need no sauce. Man, it don't need no sauce. The rib don't need no sauce, y'all. I'm telling you. But I'm just a little something on it anyway. It don't need no sauce. My God. Ladies, I showed y'all how to set that grill up. I did this the exact same way. If you look, see, that ain't no raw meat, that red. That's smoke rings right there. That's smoke ring. And ladies, once your man bite into that, he gonna be like, girl, where did you learn how to do? He will lose it. Okay, let me get a piece of this corn over here. Put a piece of corn on that plate right there. And this is what we got, y'all. Let me move everything. This is what we got. Gotta clean my hands, y'all. Alright, here we go, here we go. I'm trying to hurry up. I'm trying to hurry up. I'm trying to hurry up. Cause I'm gonna go take this to my man over there. He's gonna have this. This is his plate. Alright, so let y'all get in here. We got some dirty rice, right? That rice is good, y'all. I'm telling you. And we got some baked beans. With that that um Earl Campbell smoke sausage, man. Oh my god, bro. Ooh. Them beans is good, I ain't going to lie, y'all, I ain't going to lie, I ain't going to lie, I ain't going to lie. I got a video coming for both of these right here. I was doing a video on this until I decided to get on live and mess around with you guys. So I do that some other time. But this is the ribs, you know what I'm saying, with the fried corn. And this is it, y'all. So the experiment was with the corn. And I think, man, I ain't going to see here and lie to y'all. I think that was a success. I got to bite into it first before I say it was a success. Hold on. Let me see. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 That crumb just came off though. Well, we might can do this without the crumb. Let's do some jazz. Ooh. That's good. That's good. Mm. And you don't need no salt. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, that's good. I ain't gonna lie. Mm, 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 mm. 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 Mm, 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 mm. I'm out of here.
I'm out of here, y'all. Look. Hit God. You might gonna hurt me. So look. We got rib, corn. Look at that. Hmm? Look at that. Hmm? Don't hurt nobody. That's all I can say. Mm, 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 mm. Tell me now, before I leave, would y'all do the corn recipe? And you probably don't even have to have no air fryer to do this. We probably could experiment with either frying this in some grease. But I like the air fryer though. It fried that thing up pretty dang good. But man, mm, that's good. But this plate though, y'all. This plate though. But look, y'all look here. I'm southern as it gets. And when I tell y'all I don't play with y'all, right? I'm straight up with y'all. So I want y'all to be straight up with me too. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real. I enjoy each and every one of y'all, man. You know what I mean? And sometimes I do like to have fun. I play games, whatever the case may be. But at times, we do need to be serious in life. And for those of y'all who know me, I always say love and not hate in my videos. And um, for no matter what it's worth, y'all, we know exactly you know, what we're going through in life and things like that. But don't let your good turn sour because of rotten people. Just continue to let your light shine. You know what I'm saying? Let your light shine, man. And there's a few people out here that's down to no good, but then there's some awesome people up that we know of that's up to some good, whether they white, black, brown, Haitian, Oriental, Indian, or whatever the case may be. You know what I'm saying? And I like it how I like it how we was taught where we don't judge a person by the color of their skin, but we judge the person, man, by the content of their character. You, you feel me? So I always say love and not hate. So wherever you do in life, just continue, continue, man, to show more love than hate. And that's real. Love will take you a long ways, man. Love, you can go far with love. And I say, if you find love, don't let it go. Keep it, okay? Keep it. And for whatever it's worth, <laughs> wow. Yeah, let's just sit down at the table and eat together. You feel me? Let's just sit down at the table and eat together. That's one thing that we can we can also that all of us can do is just enjoy one another's company with good food. All right. So this is your boy Ray Mac. If you don't do nothing else in life, first love yourself. And if you have the heart to love others, go ahead and love others. And if nobody told you they love you, let me be the first one to say it. I love you. And there is nothing that you could do about it. So this your boy. I'm out of here. Peace. Love each and every one of you guys, all right? Be good.